Hi, I'm Dr. Parvinda Shergal. I'm a psychiatrist for the NHS, a writer, presenter, actress, filmmaker, and I am a British South Asian. I personally am so grateful that I've had the upbringing I have had, because on one side, I've had an amazing British upbringing with all the culture that we have in Britain, which is absolutely fantastic. And on the other hand, I also have had the exact same experience from my heritage being South Asian. And for me, I feel I relate so much more with patients because we have so many patients from the South Asian community and other communities of similar background. And sometimes I think if you're not from an ethnic minority background, you might not get certain jokes or certain um, family dynamics, which some people might pathologize whereas because you're from that background you think oh actually that's that's completely normal I do the exact same at home so for me I think it makes me a much better psychiatrist and I relate so much more with patients which can be really hard actually to relate sometimes to cases and to certain patients but certainly it gives me a different sort of understanding of certain patients which is so fantastic on the other hand I feel I don't think I would have accomplished so much if I didn't have the heritage upbringing that I did have. My grandparents came to the UK for better opportunity and they always told me that. And I think I've always had that at the back of my mind to be grateful for what we have with little of what we have. And I think because of, you know, watching my grandma every day pray, you know, going to the Gudwada, which is our local temple of worship, um, it's really made me, I think, calmer in my mindset. And I think there's the attitude sometimes in Britain that we have to move really quickly to the next step, to the next step in order to get to the top of the ladder and to achieve. But certainly my South Asian upbringing has made me just be grateful and take a few minutes of reflection and remember you know, how lucky we actually are. Um, certainly as a filmmaker, South Asians are so underrepresented in the film world and in Hollywood and that's why I certainly every script I write I make sure I have a lead that is a South Asian lead and that they're not stereotyped because we can't stereotype anymore I mean you look out the window you'll see every walk of life and they have so many interesting storylines like every one of us do so that needs to be represented in film um, so I certainly want to be part of that change of reducing ethnic stigma on screen as well as mental health stigma and to celebrate, you know, South Asian History Month, I think, you know, having these opportunities to talk, just like we would in any other part of history, and just listening to each other, because I know for a fact, everybody likes different kinds of foods and cultures. That's why we have all these different restaurants. So I think just being optimistic and celebrating one another and everyone's background is so helpful. And I think that's the way I'll be celebrating South Asian History Month.